So the person that song's about doesn't know. This might be them finding out. <laughs> I wrote it when I was... I want to say I was 18. Yeah, it's just a girl that I'd known um, when I was younger. She moved away to New Zealand and whew, details. Um, she like would come back every year and like in high school, like towards the end of it, like uh, 11th grade and 12th grade. We'd like hang out and like this little group that was like, you know, we knew each other when we were kids. And we just kind of caught a vibe and like hung out together and we hung out for like a week and it was like the first time that I had like just like a snap thing of like, oh fuck, I like this person. And it happened like the day before she left and she was like going traveling around the world. And a lot of things happened in between. It was like kind of dumb, but it was like, yeah, essentially a week of me being like, ah, oh, I have big feelings now. And then um, having them all like ripped away and <laughs> torn apart. And yeah, just like that last day saying goodbye. And it sucked. And everything in that song is bloody true. <laughs> so I wrote goodbye, um, obviously, like I said, like a while ago, but I wrote it with dear friend and producer Alex Lasker. Shout out Al. Um, and it was just like one of my first sessions that I'd had, like co writes. And it started so funny. I, like, was, I was waiting in a cafe for easily an hour because Al's bike had gotten a hole in the tire. He, didn't think to call um, and he rocked up yeah like maybe an hour hour and a half late we had a big chat had some food got into the studio at like three or four we were supposed to start at 12 and he was like what's going on man I was like oh I'm so sad so I was just like you know kind of bearing my, my heart to him and he just picked up a little notepad and was just like writing down little sentences that I'd say and then by the end of it we just had all the lyrics there so we could as soon as we had a melody, it was just pow, 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 song. Having Goodbye out and released feels like huge sense of relief because it's just like, yeah, it's just been around for so long. And I don't want people to feel sad, right? But I suspect it. <laughs> um, I hope it kind of soothes it a little bit. I have this gut feeling that it's just going to make things a bit worse. <laughs> But if that's what you need, you know, sometimes you just need to lean into those feelings. And like, if you feel that big, just like overwhelming loss of someone, because I, I wrote goodbye about a person that, you know, I thought about in a romantic sense, but I think it could apply to any, any number of situations as far as like, just wanting to be a part of someone's life or losing someone. You know, I, I like to think I don't do that anymore. <laughs> Seven days is probably not long enough to really get to know someone. <laughs> That's okay. If you're out there, you met someone after seven days, it's valid. <laughs> Listen to the song. <laughs>